out of this whole cage here, which, you know, is just your normal laptop size hard drive, all that was actually in this thing. So today we're going to do a slightly different video. So a few days ago, I was working on a computer. Uh, dang, where is my... I'm looking for my gimbal. Working on a computer, and I had to remove a solid state drive out of it, and sadly, one of the screws was stripped, but the drive was on the very bottom of the computer, so it didn't really matter. So I ended up just wiggling the drive back and forth until I basically broke it off so I could put the other drive in. I did that with a uh, BX500 solid state drive. That's the one that I had to break off. See how it's broken there? Now, what, I, what surprised me was what I found on the inside of this. Out of this whole cage here, which, you know, is just your normal laptop size hard drive, all that was actually in this thing was this. I'm, I'm very surprised that that's all that was in here. I honestly figured the board was as long as, you know, the whole drive. So that got me very intrigued in wondering, well, what the heck is exactly in solid state drives? Because I always thought this was a whole board. And uh, well, at least in Crucial's case, it's not. Now, as I mentioned, this is a, a BX500 solid state drive. So you can buy one of these for about 35 bucks. So what I also have here is about a now 50 to $60 solid state drive which is a Samsung Evo 860 solid state drive. This one actually, crazy enough, failed uh, after about two and a half years of use, which is very surprising. And we also have this solid state drive, OCZ technology. This solid state drive came out of a much older Windows 7 computer from 2012, 2013. So this is like, like one of the you know original solid state drives when 120 gigs oh no this was only 60 gigs so when 60 gigs in 2012 or 2013 this would have been like a 250 dollars part probably and then i have whatever a king fast is this drive failed literally after a year from a refurbished computer uh but i know it's a very cheap solid state drive that's probably like 15 dollars or something i'll pop it up and show you so what we're going to do is I'm going to find my gimbal and we're going to see what's inside of all of these drives. So let's see what's inside of a solid state drive. And while I go to look for my gimbal and, and start this project, uh, I just want to say make sure you check out indulgeclothing.com. That's our merch website where you can pick up our shirts that we wear, which sadly I don't have on right now. And also click the like button down here and subscribe to us. Let's get to this. All right, so this is the uh, no-name brand drive, as I'm calling it, the OCZ technology. And this is what I figured most solid states looked like. That's just metal for whatever reason. And then a uh, full plate here of motherboards with chips. And, you know, this is what I was genuinely picturing. I didn't undo these screws, but this is what I thought it would look like. This is what I thought all of them would look like, not the not the half that we have with the crucial let's get another one undone all right so cheap knockoff drive has a full one the crucial over here crucial drive has a half this is another no-name drive uh, but a newer no-name drive than this which is the king fast and uh king fast seems to be a lot more on par with the crucial except bigger so all that's left now is Samsung, which is like the name brand, top of the line, solid state drive you can get. They have the best read, write speeds and everything. Uh, but this one sadly has that screw right there. So I gotta go find my uh, toolkit. And now the holy grail, the Samsung. Yeah, I had to destroy the case to, to get it out. But this one is even smaller then well i mean i guess you could say it's about the same size but technically it's it's a little smaller than the crucial one so i find this quite interesting this is this is four different drives this is four different drives from four different companies and uh, the really old ones as you can see were the biggest this is what i thought every solid state drive looked like 
shockingly, the cheap knockoff is basically made the same way as the name brand Crucial. Um, and then the Crucial is made the same way as the expensive $60 to $80 solid state. So these little things are what are actually inside of a solid state drive. And uh, depending on which brand or model you buy, will determine what's actually in there. As I mentioned, I completely thought they were all made like this. This is what I thought every one of them looked like. That's why I was so surprised when I had to rip the Crucial out and saw this, that I just wanted to make this video and show you what's inside of them. Hope you enjoyed that. Check out indulgeclothing.com if you want to get some merch. Click the like button, click subscribe, and we will see you in the next one. Deuces.